So what's up fam fam? So we are about to get another reading and see what's gonna go on. Alright. Alright. This particular deck right here is my very first real deck that I purchased. Came with a little book and everything. Alright, I forget the name of it. Let's put your tarot your way. It was like a little star kit. It chose me. Feel me? So let's see what's been going on. Alright. She was just looking at me. I was just looking at her. I was like, you know, it's fitting. Let's go. Family, talk to me like that. Challenge accepted. All right, so, and then we have the Dragon Ore. Let's see what's going on. That one wanted to pop up, but I lost it. Let's go. Proceeding. Loss. Oh. oh, man. Interesting. So, there's been a loss, apparently. Um, Somebody's not necessarily where they need to be. Okay, nutrition. Maybe we need to work on our diet a little bit as well. Okay, nonetheless, loss. Ooh, a unicorn in the night. Okay, trying to find your way back to your path. Oh, Lord, please bless us. Let's go. Let's see what's going on. All right, King of Swords. King of Swords, emotionally detached. He's walked away. He's removed his light from the situation no more will he give in to this situation his sword's down meaning he's willing to talk nine of cups all right the high priestess so there's something we don't know just yet the nine of cups is on the table okay that true emotional fulfillment what's going to truly satisfy your soul all right that's wish fulfillment, okay? Nine, or the magician, using all the tools he's got to, you know, bring about a situation that he would like, a desired outcome, okay? And it looks like the situation was like, go up. Now, this is also information we may not be privy to, King of Pentacles. So this is a continuation of the last reading. Hmm. So after King of Swords, King of Pentacles has released the situation, he's he's manifesting, or he, at least he's released the, what he may have been manifesting, possibly. Let's proceed. The devil. Yeah, so whatever that devil energy was, remember that person over here has been released, let go of. Um, maybe there was passion that they wanted in the situation, but over and done. Now, it looks like with that high priestess, they may want to come back around. And this energy seems to be over here manifesting, doing his own thing. All right, this energy took their sweet time with the seven of pentacles. And the seven of pentacles wants to be on the table. Now, over here, it looks like they want to come around for a reunion. They do want to take it slow. They're definitely taking it slow. Okay. What's going on here? Okay, let's see what we got going on there. Boom. Alright, the King of Swords, you're back. The Hermit to the Justice. Alright, so we have the Wheel of Fortune. To the Sun. To the Three of Pentacles. They want to come around and fix the situation. They want to be on the same page. They want to help to create this masterpiece. All right. Uh, with the Wheel of Fortune, you know, you do good things, good things come to you, you do bad things, and so forth. But it looks like they've done some introspective work on the situation. And with that, they were wanting to fix it. They want to make things right or better, or at least be on the same page. Two of Swords is something that we may not be aware of. King of Swords was back, right? About this hermit energy and wanting to reconcile, have peace in the situation. Okay, interesting. All right. Okay. Yeah, they want to come back around to the Empress. All right. They're a bit battered, bruised. I'm not going to say broken, but they're definitely going through the ringer over here. Maybe there's another team. Hmm.
talk about it. Nine of Pentacles. Oh, well, we actually need all of this. Okay, we'll look at that in a minute. All right, so Four of Pentacles. Oh, Four of Cups, excuse me. Into the King of Pentacles. Hmm. They want to stand up to this King of Swords energy. They see that they've pulled back and this is now a missed opportunity. But they're also recognizing that this energy is a King of Pentacles. Somebody of value. Somebody who doesn't have time to waste. Somebody who is of... Did I say a value? Definitely a value. Five of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, Ten of Wands. The problem is this Empress has truly let the situation go. They want to seize an opportunity, but with the Five of Pentacles here... Um... That's their own, that's the blockage that they've created. This pre-Empress energy, though she's single, she doesn't need somebody to be an Empress. Right, see? She's already an Empress in her own right. Mm. Wow. Okay. All right, so somebody's now looking at an offer differently. An offer to collaborate, to be on the same page. They're not looking at it differently. They're recognizing somebody's rather diligent and hardworking energy, right? Took some time to get where they got to. And it's this nine of pentacles energy. So it's they're now recognizing the journey that this em empress had to go through in order to get to where she is. And also is recognizing the uh, offer that was placed in front of them. I remember before there was the two pentacles that I was juggling. I said they was juggling on both sides. I believe this energy wasn't sure if they want the devil energy. wasn't sure if they wanted to uh, what type of offer this was. Queen of Pentacles. I don't think they were on the same page for the same type of offer. And that's what the conflict was. The issue was. I don't think this was a romantic situation, but she took it as romantic when the Empress was trying to do business. Mm. Now they're seeing this whole situation differently. Ooh. To a sword. So is this what we weren't aware of? Because I definitely said there was something we were unaware of. Or maybe we weren't privy to. Alright, let's go. The star. Two wands, the judgment, and the page of cups. So yeah, this energy is recognized. Look, the only way I'm gonna get this emperor's back is to come forward and apologize and fix things, make things right. I gotta sound the horns, gotta sound the trumpets, all the divine orchestration possible. We gotta get this thing moving. Okay, five of cups. Just some regret, a little bit of sadness. Tell me. But even though there's three cups in the front that's built over, the opportunity to be friends, possibly, um, there's still some sort of soulmate connection there. All right, you don't necessarily have to be romantic in order to be soulmates. Okay, let's go. Eight of Pentacles. This could definitely be a work situation. Honestly, that's what I thought it was in the first place. Okay, let's keep going. Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so now the devil would like to give to the situation. Be a little bit warm. All right, seven of wands. The empress ain't having that. What are you here for? What do you want? You had your chance. You blew it. Towards that communication that comes their way, but this energy is gonna want to work with them now. Mm -hmm. oh, four of wands. So there's a potential for them to be successful, but the energy that's holding back has to get out of the head and move forward and make their play. Otherwise, you're going to miss your opportunity. She's already let you go, and I don't think you're aware of that. Um, this Empress is a King of Swords, which means she pulls out her Sword of Truth. Logical, cut, done. Tell me? Queen of Swords, she's going to reason, listen, all that fairness. King of Swords don't care. It is what it is. Feel me? Right is right, wrong is wrong, and you're out. Okay? Four of Wands to the Four of Pentacles. To the nine of swords oh now you're having recurring thoughts sleepless nights about the fact that you held back from something you wanted yeah i would too i would too honestly i'd be shooting myself in the foot two of pentacles you were juggling the idea of how the how the ship how the journey would be 
But now you know that you want to balance the scales and you need to make this happen. Do what it do. This is interesting, homie. Oh, man. You need some advice. Like, you need advice, advice. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um, what do we have? Okay, so I'm going to need this one. I'm going to need this one. But let's get you an animal spirit, homie. Let's see what's good and going on here because you need a little bit of help. All right. Okay, we're going to get into this one later. Let's get a picture just in case I forget. Boop. Okay. All right, let's see what's going on. Oh, crap, my bad. Let's see what's going on. I mean, that card would have been fitting because a frog is a divine feminine's energy. Hmm, that's interesting. Anywho, let's see. Let's get some advice for this homie when they... Huh, yeah, advice for this homie, please. Let's see what we get. Knight of Swords, we have Hummingbird for you. Oh, that's nice how it looks on the camera. All right, so you have Hummingbird. All right, let's see what's going on with the hummingbird spirit, animal spirit, yes. Oh, look at that. We are looking right up to it. Almost, kind of. It says positive, enthusiastic, spiritually resourceful. Mmm, hummingbird, I see you in your vibrancy. Inside the tiny hummingbird resides an endless well of energy and positivity. The hummingbird's secret is that it has learned where to gather nectar, and it returns to these sources daily for nourishment and rejuvenation. The sacred elixir springs from many sources, but usually involves nature, creativity, and exploring spirituality. Follow the way of the hummingbird and you cannot go wrong. Every droplet of life becomes sweet, every moment worth savoring. When in balance, smart, curious, and you love to learn. When out of balance, pushy, insistent, and sh sharp. And to bring into balance, you need to take a class. And that's what the book says, take a class. So, um, hopefully that helped you out. You feel me? Just go for it, I guess. You feel me? Maybe write a poem or something. I don't know. Get creative. Get funky fresh. I don't know how I was supposed to help you, but I hope it did. All right. I love you. Did that pertain to this? I don't know. You feel me? Some people are writers. I know when I hear a good beat, I could just freestyle. You feel me? So it's like, everybody got their own gym. Some people may do tarot. You know what I mean? Let me put out the best content possible. But whatever it is, you feel me? Do that contribution contribution to the ethers, and I'm sure you'll be good to go. All right? So, Olita, see, I love you unconditionally. Love and light to all parties involved. And to this empress, ooh, you are a boss for real. So I'm talking about I owe you a cup of coffee. Let's go get it. You feel me? All right. Love and light. Let's go.